Chapter 5 of the Revelation of John, American Standard Version. This is a LibriVox recording. All LibriVox recordings are in the public domain. For more information and to find out how you can volunteer, please visit LibriVox.org. Recording by Sam Stinson, by HisFaith.com. Chapter 5 And I saw in the right hand of him that sat on the throne a book written within and on the back, close sealed with seven seals. And I saw a strong angel proclaiming with a great voice, Who is worthy to open the book and to loose the seals thereof? And no one in the heaven or on the earth or under the earth was able to open the book or to look thereon. And I wept much, because no one was found worthy to open the book or to look thereon. And one of the elders saith unto me, Weep not. Behold, the lion that is of the tribe of Judah, the root of David, hath overcome to open the book, and the seven seals thereof. And I saw in the midst of the throne, and of the four living creatures, and in the midst of the elders, a lamb, standing as though it had been slain, having seven horns and seven eyes, which are the seven spirits of God, sent forth into all the earth. And he came, and he taketh out of the right hand of him that sat on the throne. And when he had taken the book, the four living creatures and the four and twenty elders fell down before the Lamb, having each one a harp and golden bowls full of incense, which are the prayers of the saints. And they sing a new song, saying, Worthy art thou to take the book and to open the seals thereof, for thou wast slain and didst purchase unto God with thy blood men of every tribe and tongue and people and nation and madest them to be unto our God, a kingdom and priests, and they reign upon the earth. And I saw, and I heard a voice of many angels round about the throne, and the living creatures, and the elders, and the number of them was ten thousand times ten thousand, and thousands of thousands, saying with a great voice, Worthy is the Lamb that hath been slain, to receive the power and riches and wisdom and might and honor and glory and blessing. And every created thing which is in the heaven, and on the earth, and under the earth, and on the sea, and all things that are in them, heard I saying, Unto him that sitteth on the throne, and unto the Lamb, be the blessing, and the honor, and the glory, and the dominion, for ever and ever. And the four living creatures said, Amen. And the elders fell down and worshipped. End of chapter 5